DNA replication starts at a sequence of nucleotides, called the origin of replication. An enzyme called helicase, breaks the bond between nitrogenous bases. The two strands of DNA split. During DNA replication, single-stranded DNA binding protein molecules, bind to the newly separated individual DNA strands, keeping the strands separated by holding them in place so that each strand can serve as a template for new DNA synthesis. To start DNA replication, an RNA primer called primase creates RNA primers complementary to parent DNA. The bases attached to each strand then pair up with the free nucleotides found in the cytoplasm. Adenine paired with thymine, cytosine paired with guanine. The complementary nucleotides, are added to each strand by DNA polymerase 3, to form new strands. Since the two strands are antiparallel, one DNA strand, called the leading strand, is replicated from 3 to 5 end, continuously in the same direction as the moving fork, while the other the lagging strand is replicated in the opposite direction, in the form of short Okazaki fragments. When DNA polymerase 3 reaches the RNA primer, it is replaced by DNA polymerase 1 which removes the RNA, and replaces it with DNA. DNA ligase joins Okazaki fragments. Two new DNA molecules, each with a parent strand and each with a new strand are formed. This replication is known as semi-conservative replication, because one of the old strands is conserved in each new DNA molecule.